everyone kill a burp boy here. And today I'm going to be making more super forms for other Sonic characters. Now, if you haven't watched Making Super Forms for Other Sonic Characters Part 5, I suggest you watch this video and then come back to this one if you want. So last time I made Super Forms for Tails Doll, Omega, Ray, and myself, so let's see what characters get Super Forms this time. Rennie Rose and KirbyFan9000 both said they wanted to see a Super Form of Charmy, so let's do it. Alright, I'm done. This is Super Charmy. When I searched up images of Super Charmy, I couldn't really find anything, so I actually had to get creative with this. And the first thing I did is that I made the parts of him that were originally black, now white. Except for the parts of his clothes that were black. But the parts of his clothes that were originally orange are now yellow. And that's basically it for Super Charmy. King of Speed asks if I can do a super form of the Red Wolf avatar from Sonic Forces, so let's do it. For those of you who are wondering who I'm talking about, I'm talking about this character from Sonic Forces. You're able to customize him. He doesn't have an official name, but everyone calls him Gadget for some reason, so that's the name I'm going to be calling him for the rest of this video. Okay, I'm done. This is Super Gadget. Now, the first thing you can probably tell is that his super form is blue. If you're wondering why, I'm about to explain why right now. The super form is supposed to take inspiration from this poster for Sonic Forces, where Gadget is blue instead of red. Why is he blue? I don't know. All I know is that it's just there, so yeah. That's basically all I have for Super Gadget. Glitch the Hedgehog wanted to know if I can make a super form for Metal Knuckles, so let's do it. Okay, this one I had fun making, so let me just show you so I can get it over with. This is Neo Metal Knuckles. When first looking at Neo Metal Knuckles, the first thing you can tell is that he resembles Neo Metal Sonic. This is inspired off this Neo Metal Knuckles artwork I found. So I tried doing something similar to that, but with a few changes. For one, the bottom of his arms and his waist are now green and have spikes that resemble the spikes he has when he's not in a super form. And his shoes are shown to be less detailed, but do have spikes on the bottom of them. Since Neo Metal Sonic's shoes are also less detailed, I tried doing the same thing with Neo Metal Knuckles. I did these changes because I didn't just want to straight up copy the thing I found, so... Yeah, we're basically- Done with Neo Metal Knuckles. And we're done. Of course, this doesn't mean I'm done, so just let me know in the comments what Sonic characters you want to see get super formed for the next time I do this type of video. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.